Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is future Hannah talking right now. It is actually Thursday and the clip that you're about to see of me and my sister working out is from Monday. So today's Thursday and I haven't gone to the gym since Monday. Tuesday was a very busy day for me. Wednesday, yesterday was Halloween and today I'm finally getting back at it. It's currently 1045 right now, 11 and yeah, I'm just gonna record for you guys, but the workout me and my sister did from Monday that you're gonna see like right now is from a YouTuber. Her name is Jade Venetia. I believe that's how you say her last name. I apologize if that's not how you say it, but she did a full on workout using just cables. So I saw her workout, loved it. She's a great YouTuber. You guys should definitely go check her out. I will link her video down below. I wanna give credit where it's due. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoy my little workout video vlog for you guys. And if you guys have any tips for me, I am in no way a professional whatsoever. Um, I get my tips from like YouTubers and Instagrammers. So I would love for your guys' tips on my form or better exercises for me. But anyway, yeah, I hope you guys subscribe to my channel. Click the bell while you're at it so you get notified when I post my next video. And let's just get right into this. So first up for this exercise, if you do go ahead and watch Jade's um, video that I will be linking down below. She did have like a little whole format of what she did at the end of her video. So to begin, we are doing the wide leg sumo cable squat four sets of 12 reps. So again, sumo squats are pretty self-explanatory. When I think of a sumo, it's like really wide stance. So that's what you're doing. And then you're just pulling back with the cable, really squeezing your butt in. And yeah, I really like this one. And I have mentioned this before, but I really like recording my exercises or my workouts because it really helps me analyze what I'm doing. Um, and for me, it looks like my body, like my upper half of my body is kind of leaned forward a little bit too much. If you see my sister's, hers is very straight. And I feel like I'm kind of letting that weight pull my upper body forward and not keeping that back straight. So next thing we did here was the kneeling pull through and I kind of did this first set wrong. Um, you'll see actually how my sister does it and then how I end up doing it. I'm kind of sitting back on my heels and I think Jade did this too in hers but um, my sisters really tended like really worked a lot better so this is she kind of just stuck her butt out and really squeezed through that. Again there's so many different exercises out there that I'm sure that what I was doing was something but this worked a little bit better for me um, and not saying that the first one didn't but as you see here my sister did it just like this as well and in the beginning I didn't have a mat down and I ended up getting a mat because this hurts your knees so bad you guys. Next is a very similar exercise. This is the standing pull through. I've done this one a lot before and I like to kind of give my leg a little bit of a bend and really pull that up and as you can see I'm really squeezing my butt and kind of making that ugly butt my sister almost just fell um, but yeah I really like this one as well and I have done this one before you really feel this one in your glutes that's why this is one of my favorite exercises I really like cable exercises so as soon as I saw this post I really wanted to try these and you guys let me tell you these are killer my next exercise, I am just doing a squat with a medicine ball. This is just 8 pounds and I am tossing it up in the air and squatting as soon as I catch it back down. This really works your quads and also obviously your arms. Now, I suck at these, you guys. If, you can tell, but I'm willing to show you guys because I want to get critiqued and I want to know how to better this. I know I'm locking my knees, um, but... I wasn't really sure how to do that. I wasn't sure if I needed to widen my stance or what was going on. Like I really couldn't get deep into those. Um, so then I tried to do it with no weights and it helped a little bit more. But I was still locking my knee. So any tips you guys, please leave them in the comment section down below. Okay, so today is, what day is it? Thursday. Um, and I am finally going back to the gym. I haven't gone to the gym since the last clip that you guys saw, which was Monday. So when my, like when me and my sister worked out, that was the last time. Tuesday, I don't really know. It was just a really long day for me. I actually had a photo shoot set up and then the guy bailed. So I was just pissed off the rest of the day. Um, and then Wednesday, yesterday was Halloween. So I was really busy. I was handing out candy and everything. But today I am back on track. I think it's around 10.30, almost 11. 
and I have kind of been able to see a difference. I just ate breakfast for the first time in like two, three weeks. I don't eat breakfast a lot, so that kind of sounds bad, but I eat my meals later in the day just because. Um, but I have, like, I feel like I haven't gotten that bloated lately. Like, I just had a really hefty breakfast. I drank a whole lot of water and I drank a whole lot of coffee. Um, but I feel like I haven't got bloated, so... But this is what I'm wearing right now, just some leggings and my, <laughs> this is Brian's sweatshirt, so sorry Brian, but I'm gonna go work out in this. Um, and like I said, I feel like I haven't gotten that bloated lately, like I just ate a full meal. Um, I don't know, I'm feeling pretty good, but I don't think I have like lost any weight obviously because I've only been working out for like a week. So, no, now it's gonna be like a week and a half. I'm gonna say a week straight because I did skip like two days, but I'm just gonna wear this. Um, I'm thinking I'm gonna do some cardio. I never really do cardio, but I'm gonna do a little bit different in cardio. So like jumping jacks and I don't know, just like a full body workout actually, yeah. But anyway, I will see you guys at the gym. So for this next exercise, I'm just starting off with a little ab circuit here. I did, of course, like all my other workouts, I got this from Instagram. So I saw this girl try this and I knew Planet Fitness had like the little half yoga ball. Don't know what it's called. Um, but what she did here was she kind of pulsed as you kind of see where I'm, what I'm doing right there. And then she did like a full sit up with that but her legs were like really tucked in right behind her butt. So it was truly just like your core lifting you up. And guys, I didn't think this would do anything but holy cow, it was a lot harder than I thought. Um, but again, I kind of just pulse for the first one and then go all the way up. <laughs> but yes, I am struggling and I really like this workout. I'm definitely going to be doing this again. And for all the exercises that I did record for you guys, I did three sets of eight for all of these. So again, I'm just going to show you guys some of the little fails that I do at the gym. So I tried to do, because um, when the girl posted these on Instagram I thought it was something like this but I did it kind of wrong um, I should have just left my leg sit there and bring my like head towards my knee but this almost is kind of like a little side crunch and I did it all right um, but you guys will see like how I should have been doing it but this is like an actual exercise but on my left side I don't know why but I just could not get it like what is going on I look like I'm having a seizure. So this is what I was trying to do with that exercise that I just showed you guys. So keep my knee up and bring my like head or elbow, I guess, to touch my knee. This works really nicely, but I really wanted, I think I should have um, kind of like extended my body a little bit more, like gone all the way down. As you see kind of here, I'm just like quickly trying to get it done with. Again, like I really like recording my exercises because it really helps me analyze what I'm doing. Um, but I feel like I should have kind of extended my back a little bit more on that. And yeah, I don't know. Then after that, I just did another three sets of eight for that first like half crunch. I'm not really sure what it's called, you guys, honestly. Sorry. Um, but I really like this one, so I just kept doing it. Um, obviously, you don't want to overdo it, but I think honestly it was a pretty good exercise to keep doing. For my next little ab exercise, I am just doing some Russian twists with an 8 pound medicine ball. Um, I obviously have this sped up, but this works best when you go really slowly and just focus on your really tight core. Um, these definitely help. I think I love these ones and whenever I do them, I really feel the burn, especially the day after. But again, I'm just using an 8 pound medicine ball. Moving on to a little bit of legs, I am just taking a 30 pound kettlebell 
and doing more sumo squats. So I really like sumo squats. I feel like it really helps target your butt, especially since you have that really wide stance. And I'm trying as hard as I can to push through my heels and squeeze my butt as I go up. And I did eight of those, and then I did 15 jumping jacks in between each set. And I did, of course, three sets of eight. Next, I did a Roman deadlift just with two 20 pound dumbbells. I so badly want to say romaine lettuce. I don't know why I want to say that. Um, but I just have a little bend in my knee and I, again, I'm squeezing my butt, pushing through my heels. Not actually, not pushing through my heels this much for that one, but um, really just squeezing my butt, I guess. <laughs> Okay guys, that was the end of my workout. I tried to record as much as I could, like I always say, unless I have somebody there to record my stuff. Um, but I feel like I got a little bit better of angles today after that workout. Um, it's Thursday, I keep thinking it's Friday. I never get my days straight anymore. Um, but it's Thursday, gonna go work out again tomorrow. I did some abs. Um, the first little ab circuit you saw me do, I'm probably gonna say it in the voiceover, but I found that on Instagram. And then the rest I did legs and then I did some, after that I didn't record it, but I did lunges, um, I did some more front squats, and then I also ended on um, the leg press, so that was pretty good. And then I, um, I did a total of six plates um, and I did four reps of six. So, um, and then I ended up doing a total of two plates, so one on each side, and then I just kind of did like a little burnout. So I ended up doing 45 um, total leg presses. I tried to beat my last time. <sighs> I shouldn't be driving through this. Um, I tried to beat my last time little record that I had for 40, or no, 39, so I did 45 this time. Um, but yeah, I feel really good. I'm glad I went to the gym. Um, and again, I'm not feeling so bloated. I know I started off these little gym vlogs with saying like, I'm trying um, to eat less and drink more and just like fix me being so bloated all the time. And I'm really not feeling that bloated anymore. So I really feel great. But with that being said, please subscribe to my channel if you enjoy these. I know I enjoy making them. Um, it would mean a lot if you gave this a thumbs up as well. And I will see you guys in my next video.